Hey, what's up people? Welcome back to the channel. In case you guys are here for the first time, I'm JT. Usually where I'm sitting over here on weekends, it's pretty crowded and there'll be tons of people, crowds of people. But different times, different circumstances, different situations. By the way, today I'm actually at the uh, Jasko Eon at Bukit Indah here. This place used to be a pretty popular hangout places for locals and Singaporeans as well and I used to meet some of my friends, colleagues, ex-colleagues over here as well but anyway, I'm here to grab some essentials stuff and to make a payment as well, so follow me McDonald's is here sells the mama that sells roti, chanai, roti naan, tandoori, the main road anyway, here we go Okay, we need to scan first. Yep. Wow, pretty much empty. Except for Baskin Robbins, Vivo. No dining in. Ah. Check the way. Starbucks is here. Oh, this is all the donuts. Yeah, pretty much quiet guys. <laughs> now you guys can see no dining in, just take away. <sighs> okay, boutique shops not open. Pokong, which is the jewelry shop. Pretty quiet. Yu Yan Sang, Watson, and normal food. Oh, Shilin. Take away. Bolang. Oh, even lavender is so pretty quiet. Not much. Hey okay, guys, bring up first. Oh, the first floor and only a pet shop here is open the rest pretty much empty hmm price is closed and man this is freaking man I've never been in such a situation before Well, such is the reality. Hmm. So, close. Popular, close. Even King Sahi at the first floor is also close. No one else but me. Hey okay, guys, it's pretty depressing. <laughs> wow, first time. Yeah. 
Because for AMW, you can only use scrap food or food panda for pickups. Same goes for KFC as well. Hmm. Maybe you still can get Auntie Annie here. At least this part of the supermarket is more lively. Some life, some shops. You still have your pharmacy here. Supermarket. You get your essentials. Here's some life. And you still have your subway. Hmm. Kapao and tea as well. Oh, I think I can get one of these later on. Maybe. Anyway, guys, I go and get stuff first. Okay, plenty of organic food here. No issue. Veggies, fresh fruits, bananas, pineapples, apples. Everything still pretty stocked up. Watermelon. Don't worry about that. We still have the Japanese and Korean fashion over here as well. Just like grab a few stuff if you need it. Hmm. Nah. Don't think I need those. It's okay. The non halal section. Oh, chicken. Ah, oh, bread and eggs. Gotta go there. Pretty much all alone here. Not that many people this time. Hmm. At least they have a selection of bread. They still. Buy some bread and makan, bring home. Hmm, what to have? Still have some bread you can get. Oh. Okay guys, with that, we almost come to the end of the vlog. And uh, before ending things on a high note, Firstly, I'd like to thank you guys for all the comments you guys have posted in the vlogs. At the same time, I appreciate all the support you guys have given to help this channel to grow. And what are my immediate plans? Well, based on the current situation, this lockdown might take maybe two to three weeks, depending on how things pan out. So, interstate traveling is still not uh, committed at this problem. I, I mean, at this at this point in time, I would like to travel to places like Malacca, maybe make a trip to KL or Penang, but we can't do that right now. But we still can travel to other districts here within Johor. I'm actually based in Johor Bahru. There are still lots of things we can explore in JB, which I can showcase to you guys what are the best places or best foods uh, there is in JB. At the same time, I might be making plans to travel places like Ulu Tiram, Kota Tinggi, Disaru, and Simparagam because they still have a lot of hidden gems over there. But anyway, I will do what I do best. Till then, stay safe, be vigilant, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Signing off.